Erasmus Plus news. Today is the 1st of July and we are going to talk about Erasmus Rain Job Project. Uh, the first topic is key competencies. Uh, I hope you enjoy the video. I'm going to explain some things to take into account when you are looking for a job. First of all, you need to know your own situation. After that, you need to update your CV. Moreover, you need to know the requirements of the job. And after all of that, you need to own your own activities. The key competencies are the European Council's definition of the skills that are required when you're looking for a job. For example, if you're a person that likes to think out of the box, if you're a person that likes to take the initiative, if you're a person that likes to take risks, then you have the entrepreneurship competence. Furthermore, if you want to work abroad, there are other competencies that you will need. Firstly, you will need the cultural awareness competence. This allows you to keep an open mind and be, and be sensitive to those opinions and beliefs around you. Secondly, you will need the multilingual competence. This allows you to be able to effectively communicate with those around you and also be able to be in touch with them. Lastly, you will need the citizenship competence. This allows you to be respectful to those who live near you and it will also allow you to adapt to society's changes. On the other hand, if you're good at finances and managing your money, that means you have the mathematical competence. At last but not least, if you're an open-minded person that likes to experience new things and goes out of your comfort zone, that means you are good at the personal, social and learning to learn competence. Hello, I'm Graciela Combatti and I would like to talk about digital competencies in which I'm going to talk a little bit about digital tips. Digital tips are those tips we use to manage computers, mobile phones, and um, digital tips are useful in our everyday life in order for work, for read, and also to learn for life. I'm going to find a job abroad when I finish my education. The Europath will help me with creating a CV, code later, and job share with uh, Europath. And also, I can email the Europath as well for support. For more information, please visit the link below. I am learning English. I am finding different digital tools uh, useful to learn to language English, uh, which will help me with find a job. BBC Language English, uh, Dolingo, Stalford.com. There are different websites available for job search. Please see the link below. Uh, Europass, InfoJob, LinkedIn, and Indeed. Oh, those tips were very helpful. Thank you, girls. Uh, to finish, we are going to connect with Carmen. Okay, thank you, Andrea, for the connection. Yes, uh, I'm here at the street of Marciano with Aisha. She's a participant in this project. So tell me, Aisha, why did you participate in this project? I wanted to meet others from different backgrounds, cultures and countries to learn about the job opportunities available in Europe. After completing the project, I have learned many competencies and digital skills. Okay, thank you so much for the information. So, uh, I back to you, Andrea. Uh, this is all. Thank you. Okay, that's all for today. Uh, see you this time tomorrow. Ciao. Thank you.